this video I'm going to show you how quick and easy it is to capture and annotate screenshots with PaintShop Pro. Let's take a look at a typical work scenario. I want to take a screenshot of a website so I can mark up changes for the web designer. It's easy. To start, in the Edit Workspace, I'll go to File, Screenshot, Setup. In the Method drop-down list, I can choose the type of capture I want to initiate. Smart Capture captures an object by auto-detecting elements like buttons, menus and window areas as you hover over them on your screen. You can also initiate an area capture by dragging, so this new capture method is very flexible. Area captures the area of the screen that you select. Full Screen captures the entire screen. Client Window captures the contents of the active program. Object captures an object within the program that you select such as a menu bar, toolbar, icon, or document window. And Preset captures the preset area size. OK, I'm going to use Smart Capture to capture a website. Over on the right, you can further customize your screenshot workflow by clicking the Settings button. On the Activate Capture page, Hotkey lets you use a keyboard shortcut to capture your screen. Let's use F5. Right-click lets you capture screen contents by right-clicking to activate the capture and clicking the selected area. And Print Screen Key lets you capture screen contents by pressing the Print Screen Key on your keyboard. Delay Before Capture lets you capture screen contents after a specified delay. This method lets you capture elements that appear only when you hover over them with the pointer, such as context menus. Type a number in the seconds box to delay your capture by that amount of seconds. On the Options page, Include Cursor lets you include the pointer in the capture. Multiple Captures lets you capture multiple images. Each capture is added as a new image in PaintShop Pro. We'll select this. Hide PaintShop Pro automatically minimizes PaintShop Pro when the Screenshot tool is active. If you want to capture PaintShop Pro, uncheck this option. Highlight Color lets you change the color of the capture area preview. Capture Shortcut to Toolbar adds a quick access icon to the toolbar. Screenshot and Screenshot Setup. Let's select this. Next we have the Presets page. Let's have a look at Web Presets. As you can see, there are a number of different common web sizes pre-populated, making it easy to capture the exact dimensions of a particular web element every time. There's also a user-defined preset category meaning you can create your own screenshot preset. Simply adjust the width and height to your liking, and then click on the plus icon and name your preset. Done! Finally, the destination page lets you set the following capture destination options. Open in PaintShop as a screenshot to PaintShop Pro as a new image. Save to lets you choose a save location for screenshots. Format lets you set a file format if you have marked the Save To option. Just choose a format to save your capture to. And Clipboard saves a screenshot to the Windows Clipboard. Now that we've personalised our capture settings, we're ready to go. I'll click Start to initiate the capture. And now you can see as I hover over the boxes on the website I have open on my screen, it's detecting various elements. Let's capture this box by using the hot key we selected, F5. Since we chose multiple captures in the settings, we can keep going. I'm also going to grab the entire web page by hovering over and using F5 again. You can also make a manual selection in Smart Capture mode, simply by dragging your cursor. OK, now that I'm done, all I had to do was click the PaintShop Pro icon in the Windows taskbar to see the captures in the Edit Workspace. Let's mark up the changes I want to make to the web page. I'm going to use the Shape and Text tools to draw a box around the PaintShop Pro content to indicate I want it updated to the newest version, PaintShop Pro X9.
I'm now finished with my annotation. Next time you want to do a screenshot, you can go to File, Screenshot, Start, and you'll be ready to capture automatically using the settings you defined previously. Control-C also initiates the screenshot tool. Now you can demonstrate, communicate and collaborate with Clarity using screenshot and annotation in PaintShop Pro, at home, at work or at school. Thank you for watching.